Good day fellas, I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill and today we are going to play with a trash wagon, turd wagon, however you would call this vehicle. A lot of people thought, OMG, oh my bananas, this tank is going to be broken when it just came into the game. And reality is simple, no one plays with this shit. Well, what can I say, who could expect that? So. This is why I do not rate tanks looking into the stats only, you know, this is why I do not speak about the vehicles before the time is coming, before I am getting my hands on the, on the new vehicle and talking about it, you know, playing some games. The thing is, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, this vehicle is not very good, okay? Uh, the DPM of this tank is quite bad. Um, and obviously you are not seeing this vehicle in the, um, in the games nowadays. Uh, the gun is horrible, although on the paper it looks so good. It looks like it is the best gun ever, you know. Looking into all of this, this gun has a very, very, very nice alpha damage overall. I believe every single of you would agree with me. I mean, 400 alpha damage for a tier... Uh, for a tier 8 heavy tank is not looking bad whatsoever, so that's very worth thing to highlight. After that penetration, close to 300 penetration, oh yo papa! It's supposed to be the best tank ever, well, but reality is a bit different. So, reality is, this tank is slow, unfortunately, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. After that, whoop, let's hide this. After that, um... The tank is not very accurate, so you have bad DPM and you have bad accuracy. Two things which are not going uh, along that well, if you know what I mean. So that's a bit of the problem. After that, speaking about the armor on the flat ground, armor on the flat ground is not that great. So whenever you are connecting the dots, you are seeing, ay, 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 Dios mio, the tank is not that great, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, but that's fine. Um, the truth to be said is the tank is not very pleasant to play against for sure. The main reason being why, because it is very hard to dig this vehicle out of the hold down position. And it is a fact, I believe, every single World of Tanks player would agree with me to deal with a, with a tank, to deal with this vehicle whenever it's fully hold down, it is, it is quite a journey if I can say so myself, right? Other than that, fellas, uh, this tank doesn't have absolutely anything to offer, unfortunately. So yeah, we are using our grey DPM, um, tier 4 DPM, to be precise, to make sure the phase 1 will enjoy himself to the maximum. And as you can see, he had a great time. Now for this vehicle, it is very very slow, so turbo could be an option, but I prefer to play with a um, ventilation, rammer, and improved aiming unit to increase this accuracy as much as we physically and possibly can. The main reason being is because this tank is not very accurate vehicle itself, right? And if the tank is not... If the tank is not really accurate and once again the DPM is not looking that great, you know, I'm not here to try to sell the tanks for World of Tanks, right? Um, I am here to say the truth. Um, if the tank is good, I will always say the tank is good. If the tank is bad, I am going to say the tank is bad, right? I am I am here not to deny this or something, right? So yeah, that's about it. So far we have a very, very great game. Uh, skill, are you for real? Yep. 1.6 thousand damage, 1.2 thousand assisting damage, and it is pretty good game for this vehicle. I know usually I am aiming for a bit, let's say, better score for the tanks which uh, which are the tier 8s but with this vehicle we are feeling completely fine while having this uh, once again i am very very well aware of that uh, probably you would expect more from the uh, from the tank which is broken broken but it is not the case for us so um all in all i believe i do not need to say absolutely anything about this game Enemy team had a losing spawn, they are losing the game. I said that from the very first um, 
moment whenever this map was released it is it is made very very badly from our gaming side if you are defending the base you are going to lose most of the time and looks like people learned how to play this what is the secret take the corners and you are going to be completely fine so that's what we have anyways uh great game 15 to 0 let's teleport to the scoreboard and we are back so 1.6 thousand damage 1.6 thousand assisting damage uh this is the score we made 64 thousand that's actually okay it is um, it is pretty good income considering the game which we had let's go for round number two okay fellas so round number two what do we have we have prokurovka standard game so in this battle we will try to make this vehicle work speaking about the accuracy right what I learned from playing with this tank long time ago and while crying about this vehicle uh, was I learned you need to pretty much aim your shots and hope for the best. That's what you need to do. Snapshots is not the strongest part of this vehicle and it is very very important thing to highlight overall. Um, how we are going to start everything I think I will overpeak for a moment just to check out what I could spank for let's say 400. This is my goal, this is my dream, and this is what I am looking for. You know, early damage is always nice. Obviously, we are hoping for enemies not to react properly and not to spank us back. That's what we are hoping for. So, let's see. No. Wow, that was impressive. I did not expect it to penetrate the list like this. And we did it. Nice. Okay, so what do we have? We know there is a sniper schnitzel sitting over there. We are very, very well aware of that. And we know there is a Shrek sitting somewhere around this area as well. So we need to be kind of careful not to overpeak for no reason whatsoever. In fact, I would say I'm going with a blind shot like this. Hmm. This is not a blind shot. That's okay. Hmm very 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 hard game to play enemies have plenty of the tank destroyer so once again any mistake from my side will lead me to take one for the team so i need to be a bit smarter than this let's try to shoot over there we are going for a blind shots because we do not have anything else to do at this point and look at this beauty luckily for us enemies are thinking hopefully they are thinking of making pressure on top of the hill and yep, indeed they do. Beautiful shot into the side of the E75 TS. Obviously this gentleman made a humongous mistake and he cannot complain about this. Good. Good fellas. By the way, once again, I on this vehicle I truly prefer the improved aiming unit instead of using stabilizer. The main reason being is because this tank is becoming so much more accurate. And I would highly highly recommend for everyone to use this kind of setup on this tank okay let's wait for it there is a chance this light tank will spot someone sitting around this area that's what i would love to see aha shrek in the open field can i spank the shrek this is the question i will try to overpeak i think oh how are you doing not paying attention nice oh turtle 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 mm -hmm. Okay, Turtle is paying attention from the top of the hill. Not a big deal. We could definitely expect that. And we are feeling alright. And another Turtle sitting over there. Okay, I have a good penetration with a gold ammunition. Maybe, just maybe, fellas, we can start thinking about punishing enemy Turtles. What do you think about this? What do you think? What is the better name for this vehicle, fellas? Uh, trash wagon or Turd wagon? What do you think? Because it is a turtle over there, so maybe this tank would um, would sound better as a third wagon. Hmm? What do you think about that? Okay, so at this point, all I want to see, I want to see enemies messing up. That's all, all I want to see, fellas. That's all I want to see. Okay, listen. 
I will take this position over there. I think it is about the time. Actually, I can even go deeper for a base defense. Maybe that's the right way to do the things. Unfortunately, a lot of our forces are stuck up here, which sucks, uh, but it is obviously the case, and we cannot change absolutely anything about this. If I need to guess where enemy light tank is sitting at, I'm not speaking about this one, I am speaking about the ELC even. I would say ELC even is sitting over there. That, that would be my prediction and that would be my guess. Anyways, we are still feeling fine, we are enjoying ourselves and we are waiting until enemies are getting involved. No, let's see. Enemy team is playing better, fellas. I definitely need to give a thumbs up for the enemy forces. They have two gentlemen over there, but they have some sniper schnitzels in the back. So if our team will try to be aggressive, unfortunately our team is going to take one for the team. But maybe I am wrong. I hope I am wrong, fellas. I hope I am wrong. Okay, I decided to go for a blind shot for Vaza in this bush. Maybe. Just maybe it will work just fine. Fellas, there is one rule which I am following all the time. And that rule is, if you do not know what to do, do not do anything. I can tell you that. And in this kind of situation, I do not really feel that confident to um, push that much in front or to, let's say, get involved to the maximum. I do not really think it is worth it. So instead of trying, instead of taking one for the team, we are going to be patient and simply wait until enemies will F up and until they are going to make something, something silly, right? In the same time, we know this turtle is feeling quite confident. Why am I saying so is because this guy wasn't spotted in a while. So maybe, just maybe, if we are going to take this bush over there, we are going to spot this turtle. This is very, very important thing. If we are out spotting the Mr. Turtle, we are going to, we are going to spank them like there is no tomorrow. I am asking for our guys to pray him over there and spotting and coming in 3, 2, 1, turtle is sitting here, I am aiming for cupola, unfortunately we cannot hit that, it is not fully aim at shot for obvious reasons, right, meanwhile we have the light tank over there, yeah, unfortunate, and obviously Jeff who is trying to punish us for our stupidity, not exactly what I am looking for, but that's what we have, okay, uh, the question is, can I try to punish them trying to get involved? Look at this. Okay. Vazay is saying... This is exactly what Vazay is saying. And we are eliminating him from the game. Nice. Maybe we can actually win this game. It would be, it would be very, very good. By the way, enemy art is trying to dig the living crap out of me. He is trying to spank me every single time. But oh boy. He is failing, good, and our Arta has a great RNG, or extremely good aim, or both, or both, ooh, this guy is MVP honestly, okay, let's finish this guy up, why so, because we need to, now when we have one sniper less in the, um, in the back, we can start working on this module 1, Ergashem was spotted, oh, Ergashem was, um, wasn't spotted, but I think he is sitting around this area, which is completely understandable. So all we need to do at this point, at this point we need to be a bit patient. That's all we need to do. Meanwhile, this, this Arta will uninstall the game, I'm telling you. He is so angry, I can see him steaming from, uh, from the air, okay? He fired so many times at me. He either missed or he either um, stunned me with no damage whatsoever. Great game, fellas. What can I say? Great game. Okay, it's still too late. By the way, one thing which I really need to highlight is um, this vehicle, it is weak for Arta. And I'm not joking, I'm not being sarcastic, because usually when the tanks are having a great armor, they are not so weak for Arthas. But this one does have armor, especially if you are playing hold down. 
but in the same time it is relatively weak for uh, um, for Arta, right? So whenever Arta will hit you, even such a pesky Arta like Lorraine, right? He is going to do some massive damage for you. So this is very important thing to highlight as well. Okay, at this point, what could happen? I have a big feeling, fellas, this ELC might try to push like this. So what I need to do, I need to use those bushes to protect myself. ELC might push like this. Okay, let's prepare for this. Okay, enemy turtle. <laughs> <laughs> Scale enemy turtle is after you. He is my friend and he is hunting you. Unbelievable. How dare you to hunt baboons? How dare you? Shame on you. Okay. Good. We are in the typical bush. I am feeling great about this. We are feeling completely fine. So, all I want to see, I want to see ELC even trying to make a bit of pressure. Mm-hmm. This is down to fartable. Okay. Good boy. Good boy. Come here. That Arta. That poor Arta. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. That poor Arta. Ay, 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 ay. So unfortunate for this gentleman. Meanwhile, can we hit this? That was important shot and I missed that. Okay, this is not what I'm looking for now. Turtle might try to get involved once again. Keep this in mind. Mm -hmm. Not a big surprise, and Progetto is down to one shotable as well. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, Turtle is getting in the wall of it. Let's deal with him. Mm -hmm. Nothing what I can change about this, fellas. I'm accepting this, and I am hoping for the best in this kind of situation, right? Okay, fine, fair play. Unfortunately, not a victory, but we did absolutely everything what we could. Uh, keep this in mind. We, we are kind of only wants to have the crossfire in the middle, right? Uh, unfortunately, I would love to say we would have a couple of more guns, but it is how it is. All in all, enemy team, in my opinion, played a bit better. I think they had more people in the middle. I think whoever played on top of the hill, they spotted a lot of our forces trying to make pressure like this, right? And they pretty much, uh, and the turtle uh, farmed a lot of them while playing from here great play by the turtle only thumbs up for this gentleman elc did a proper job by spotting from the typical bush and after that obviously he's alive in the last moment of the game uh, good for him nothing to say nothing to add well played okay let's teleport to the scoreboard okay boys so mm, we are back with a defeat, unfortunate, but we did 3.5 thousand damage, 1.2 thousand assisting damage. Great job by the platoon of the turtles. This turtle was on top of the hill. He was spotting for the other turtle and other turtle was shooting everyone. Very, very, very good play by those gentlemen, right? All in all, our ELC spotted a lot and our Erga Shem spanked everyone what he physically and possibly could. Maybe couple of more guns and we could win the game, right? All in all, I am feeling happy. Let's go for a round three. You know what? I want, I do not want to sell you this vehicle. I am telling you straight, the tank is not good and we are getting game like this. I'm a bit disappointed, fellas. Anyways. Round number three, go! Okay, what do we have, fellas? We have a tier eight matchmaking in pretty good map for a heavy tank. But now the question is, how everything will look like. Um, I can tell you one thing. I would love to see our team failing and enemies making pressure and us sitting on top of the hill and trying to punish them for their stupidity. But it's not going... Oh, it is not going to be that simple. Look at this ELC. ELC. Brrr. He's only one playing over there. Okay, maybe it's not that bad. So listen, I am not going to make a hardcore pressure like this because it's just simply pointless and it is not worth it. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this position over there and I will wait until enemies will try to make pressure like this. If enemies will make pressure like this, we are going to farm them for days. If enemies are not going to make pressure like this, we are not going to lose that much. Okay, three out of four heavy tanks are spotted. 
this is very bad sign for us honestly this is very very bad sign for us i do not want to cross through the middle because usually whenever you are crossing through the middle like this you are taking a lot of um for the team and i am not willing to um make a risk like this i honestly think it is not worth it now what could happen enemies might have couple of the gentlemen sitting around this area and trying to wait until um someone will try to make like a pressure like this and once again unfortunately we do not have enough forces to do so i mean they could have three guns who are pushing progetto borat T-34 slash 3, um, the same ELC even is probably sitting either here, yeah, probably he's sitting over there. It doesn't look good, fellas. It doesn't look good. How to get involved and how not to lose uh, any hit points whatsoever for now? This is the question. Yeah, this is not looking great. Okay, looks like uh, I need to... I need to say hashtag never lucky, fellas. Um, I was wishing our team to take one for the team, if I can say so, and I think I talked too much. I think I talked to that level, our team is going to take way more than one for the team. That's what I think. Not a big surprise, though. Okay, we have a Shining um, T um, Type 59 Gold, right? Okay. Okay. Let it be. So what is the goal? Unfortunately, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I cannot make that much pressure. Speaking about the Tornwagen, it's created for one particular thing. And that particular thing is to hold the line somewhere. You are sitting somewhere and you are sitting hold down. And you are pretending life is beautiful. This is what this tank is created to do. So we are going to take our time. Since we are slow as fast as a turtle, we are going to go on top of the hill and we will hope for Progetto and Bora trying to make a bit of pressure like this. If they are going to do that, we are going to start spanking them. Once again, not ideal situation by any means. I would love to say we would have a bit more forces somewhere over there. For example, sitting in this bush and knocking everything down. But it is not going to be as simple as I would love to... Um, as I would love to say, I am politely asking our guys to go back because this is the way for us to do the things because otherwise it is not going to be fun, right? But this is going to be hard, fellas. This is going to be hard. Score is 2 to 5. Soon the defense is coming, fellas. So far, 4 minutes of shit, unfortunately. By saying this, I mean... Our team is just simply taking one and enemy team is having a blast. This is what is happening so far. Okay, Progetto is sitting in very good position. Nice. Mate, if you have some time, please knock the trees. Uh, this is this is good. This is good. We have one sniper schnitzel. I would love to say we would have more than that, but unfortunately we do not. We will play on top of the hill and from the top of the hill we can actually spank enemies whenever they are going to do something silly. Could this be epic comeback? Maybe? Possibly? What do you think? What do you think is the chance of the mega comeback? Okay, that's one gentleman. How are you doing? First shot of the game. Uh, 13 against 5. Well, I believe only in the dreams. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, only in the dreams, I guess. But you know what? I like my dreams. I like my dreams. Okay, so let's see. Obviously, there is plenty of the enemies who are making pressure through the open field for obvious reasons, right? That's understandable. Unfortunately, they are just, they have way too much meat. All they need to do, they need to make a bit of pressure here and they can uh, spank all of us, I guess. Oh, shame. What can we do? Progetto is doing a great job, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, but it is just simply a matter of the time whenever Progetto will die. I can promise you that. The thing is, 
this tank this tank doesn't have a dpm what this tank has this tank has a very very solid turret armor okay the turret armor of this vehicle is rock solid but unfortunately this is all this tank got you do not have absolutely anything else that's okay i'm trying to go back like this and there's a reason why i'm trying to do that because hopefully we can craft a better angles to punish them and unfortunately this is game over i do not really think i will be able to get one more shot maybe i will maybe i won't and as you can see dpm is just not lasting as much as i would love to say yeah that's fine that's fine fellas so that's the last game right still could you play this game differently honestly it doesn't really matter um I could go like this, I would get punished uh, for this. I could go play here, it wouldn't change absolutely anything. Enemy team was stronger and they uh, deserved to win. So speaking about this session, we had one victory when we had a better spawn. Unfortunately, in the other situations, things went uh, a bit differently, which is sad, but it is the case. So all and all, 2.3 thousand damage, hip hip hooray. <laughs> Strong as it sounds, we are top by the damage, we are second by experience, we fired eight times, we penetrated six. Um, one penetration uh, was definitely unfortunate, I would say, but it is how it is. Uh, I'm speaking about this TM1 to 2 going, but it doesn't really change anything, it would be GG anyways. 46,000 profits. You know what, in the end of the day, looking into this score, holy bananas, fellas, even though we won only... One out of three, but look at this 2.5 thousand damage and 1000 assisting damage. Um, and for this tank, it is good, and I'm not joking. When I played with this tank for Mark of Excellence, I barely got 2.5 thousand and 500. Um, and it was one of the worst experiences for me to play with this vehicle. So I hope I refreshed your memory with this vehicle. Uh, if this tank will be on sale, I would highly recommend you not to think about it because it is not a great vehicle. Um, and I hope you were very, very well entertained. Th third game was very, very slow, unfortunately. But, you know, I cannot make the game faster, unfortunately. I just can't. So... Thank you very much for everything, thank you very much for watching, take care, and that was your daily dose of skill. Skill is out for today. Peace.